Hey drivers, this is Andrew at Third Coast RC here in Houston and uh, we're going to talk to you today. We've got something cool, some new product in our, in our shop and that is going to be this. This is the RGT Crusher Crawler. Now previously these have primarily only been available through Banggood's shipping from China um, but we're actually now stocking them in our store here in, uh, here in Houston and uh, so here it is it's kind of like a old school type of uh, body look to it old school truck body to it so this is this is the kind of like um, yellowy colored one and um, it comes in a few different colored body shells you can see here that it comes in the yellow the red and the green and we are we are stocking all of these um, so what do you get in the box where well, you get the truck you get this cool it's a good radio actually it's a four channel radio so if you want to run ancillary items on here then you've got third channel activation here and a fourth channel activation here so you can run lights it's already got lights on it we'll talk about that in a minute and it comes with a winch you can get a winch for it too um, so maybe you could run a winch or something else that you want to run off there um, it does have mountains for a winch here in a box you get the charger it comes with a nickel metal hydride battery uh, with a Dean's plug, a T plug on it. So we've got uh, a little charger. And then what else do we get? We get the uh, instruction manual in here. We get a sticker set. The sticker set is actually for on here, for like on the bed. You can put like diamond plate or you can choose wood for on on, on the bed part here, which is, which is kind of cool. You get a choice to do the wood. Or the diamond plate what else do we have here we have extra battery straps um, if you want to perhaps go to a bigger capacity battery then you can use these straps they include those we got a uh, spare spare screws perhaps these are for the bead locks I'm not sure because it has bead locks and then it's got uh, we got the wheel caps yeah they're not installed we have on the truck has a full-size spare with the wheel cap already installed are well, the little screws are to hold the wheel caps on I see what they're for now so there to hold the wheel caps on so that's that's what you get in the box nice controller and uh, some nice stickers you got all these other kind of stickers um, some of them are kind of generic and some of them are kind of like pseudo real stickers discovery channel network off-road look at that I didn't know there was a discovery channel off-road I'm gonna have to look for that tonight on my uh, uh, on my cable TV um, so what do we get what do we get what are the specifications of, uh, of this truck well we get some it comes with some real with some with some good upgrades ready to go this, this truck is very it's quite popular in the online environment and now here it is in here available in the States so it comes with a 550 motor and um, it comes with an adjustable front bumper you can move it in and out it comes with trailer hooks on the rear and on the front actually has a unique kind of horizontal rear suspension we'll look at that some more in a minute we've got a four channel uh, receiver system it comes with the hobby wing 1060 brushed esc that also supports lipos you've just got to move the jumper over so if you want to run a lipo in this truck uh, you can do and i believe you can run a 3s lipo with this uh, with this um with this esc um it's got metal shocks threaded shock bodies metal threaded shock bodies all around it's got the cool flip body shell cantilever style and it's got the cantilever style suspension as well and we've got a CVD metal drive shaft so it comes with metal drive shafts from the factory not plastic they're, they're all metal and then we got uh, all metal gears in the uh, in in the transfer cases and in the diffs and everything like that and a slipper clutch system uh, on, on the main gear. The servo that it comes with is a 15 kg which is a reasonable servo it's all metal geared but there are a little bit stronger ones than that right now but it's not a huge truck that needs a lot of massive torque on the servo so that, that that's a good servo um, so that's that's some of the specifications that it uh, that it comes with. So let's let's take a closer look at the truck so like I say it comes in this kind of like yellowy orange color the red and like a like a drab almost camo green color it comes in we've got all colors in stock it's got working headlights on the front it's got indicators 
that work when you go to full lock the indicators come on and flash we'll show that in a minute it comes with the side mirrors it comes with like a cool kind of air intake old school vertical exhaust stack it's got a um, fire extinguisher a full fire extinguisher here and um, it's got the beadlock wheels on it with these pretty soft and aggressive crawling tires these do feel really like quite good quality um, wheels and tires on here full bead locks um, looking underneath we can see it comes with these are actually metal um, plates on the differentials front and rear we've got the steel these are metal metal drive shafts which is a big upgrade there are some of the red cat crawls we sell don't come with these they're an option uh, we've got these um, supporting um, supporting rods here and uh, yeah it's a it's a it's a real nice design with a metal here we can see this is a metal frame um, on the chassis and the suspension is this kind of like unique cantilever style design like a knee you see it here moving up and down almost like a knee so in order to lift the body up there's a body clip underneath here right there that I've removed you remove that body clip and then you can just grab the body give it a little wiggle and it pops up be careful not to yank the lights out but they're on an easy disconnect here if you want to put the body all the way up and the rear is towards the rear the rear light is there and the front lights are here and it comes with this nickel metal hydride battery it's only a 2000 milliamp so you're probably only going to get 15 20 minutes crawling on this battery that's probably one of the first upgrades the battery is held down both with this kind of clamp and the clamp you just grip it and it comes off and it snaps back on but the battery is also held with velcro underneath as well well i say it does come with those velcro straps as well that go around here so if you need to uh, put a bigger battery in that this won't clamp onto that this clamp won't clamp onto if you use a fatter battery or a lipo that's not the 3s probably not going to be held by this but they do give you the velcro straps which is a, which is a nice addition so we can see here the rear suspension which is kind of unique to this vehicle i'm just going to pull these out so we can put this on the up so we can see here the rear suspension a style rear suspension solid axle front and rear um, with this cantilever style suspension so that's something that's a bit unique to uh, to this to this particular truck and um, we can see it's got a 550 motor not a 540 so it's a little bit longer um, a high torque and um, I think it is I read somewhere what exactly the turn was on it um, I think it's a 16 or a 17 turn motor and it's a 15 kilogram servo and it also comes with a metal servo horn so you see here we've actually got a metal servo horn on here so this truck really if you look at it's got the aluminum shock bodies here with the threaded aluminum shock bodies which a lot of trucks don't come with it's got the metal servo horn it's got the metal drivetrain already built into it um, so it comes a light kit already installed on it so really that's a lot of um, a lot of hop-ups already installed on this uh, on this truck so what I'm going to do is I'm going to reconnect the lights here make sure I get these the right way around I guess with them being DC it might not matter we'll plug them back in like so I think they were the other way now that's the rear so this is the front front goes in the front rear goes in the rear and we've got that all hooked up so let's take a quick look at the radio radio like I say is a four channel underneath here we've got the standard adjustments and trims um, for different things and throttle reversing and steering reversing and it runs on four double A batteries four double A's and uh, it feels nice it's, uh, you know it doesn't have a rubber cover on the steering wheel but it's got some texture on here so you can feel it I mean it doesn't feel cheap it feels it feels reasonably good the fourth channel has three positions so I guess that's if you perhaps want to put in a 
a two or a three speed transmission or something in here or do something different the third channel is just a single press so it's one way or another on the third channel so we turn on the radio it's got a nice blue glowing light here and then we'll lift this up and we'll turn on turn on the vehicle little on off switch just here and uh, you can see the headlights have come on they are quite bright it's a very bright sunny day today here but well, you can see that the headlights are really uh, really quite bright and give a good light and uh, we've got these tow hooks on the front here and if you turn the wheels like I was saying to full right or full left it doesn't do it when it's only partial turn it's only when you go full turn the indicators come on which is a nice little touch in the back it's only got this um, high running light in the rear up here and that that comes on when you go into reverse yeah so you see it comes on there when you come into reverse that comes on so it's not really going to illuminate the back of the, anything behind but it it, it, it comes on um, yeah it doesn't act as a brake light or anything like that it just comes on in reverse um, so this thing looks really cool so let's put it on the ground and see how it runs so we'll put it down the ground here and uh, we'll just drive it around the parking lot. I'm not going to go crawl it anywhere. This is going to be a demo model. Might go over the curbs a little bit to show you some of the movement. Speed-wise, it's a crawler, so that's full speed right there. Go back around. Looks cool. It's got hill braking, and then into reverse. Same speed in reverse as forwards. We can take it over here and grab, grab it up this uh, curb over here. So we'll take it up the curb here. <laughs> as easy as that. That was absolutely flawless. You can see the suspension move there. So it comes back down there. Let's get a bit closer and do that again. I really like the way that rear suspension moved there. With that solid axle rear. So here we go. Nice and slow. Look at the movement on that rear suspension. That is really quite impressive. Very, very fluid movement. And a lot of movement. There it goes, coming back down. No body drag, nothing touching, going up that kind of like seven inch curb there, six, seven inch curb. No problem. So, this truck, it's gonna retail for 395, 399 I think. Um, we got them here in our store in Houston and um, we might be putting them in our online store too. We're going to get all the parts in stock this week and we're doing a, going to order a full set of everything for this truck because we're really going to try and support this one. We don't sell any vehicles without having parts so this one's coming to our store. It's available now. You can come and pick one up today. We're open till 4. Um, but this video probably won't go up till later today but we're open every day 10 till 7 except sunday which we're open 12 till 4. so come and check it out come and check out the rgt crusher if you're looking for something that's different that's got lights already installed there's a very unique very fluid suspension there that looks like it works really really well then uh, this might be the vehicle for you so please subscribe to our channel check us out on instagram and on facebook all third coast rc and thanks for watching see you next time